Hey everyone, this is Scarlet, back with a little bit more Let's Play Xenosaga. When we last left off, we were in the commander's room. As Ziggy. And we're pretty much done with this section, there's not much more after this, except... One fight, which you don't actually need to win. Also, there's dudes. But it's okay, we're gonna go right the hell by them. Because we can! <laughs> hey mom, oh hey Zigster. Margulous, because of course. Good going, Ziggy. I forgot to do the leveling stuff on either of them. I see. This is not going to end well. It's that body of yours that got you this far. Pretty much. I'm just gonna throw this fight because I don't really care very much. The item you get isn't they couldn't stop perfect. A lone Shut up. Ziggy, this is the guy. Yeah, I know. Looks like I'm about to get some decent exercise. And this baby's quite pleased as well. Uh almost sounded like sexy times with the sword. Now boss fight with Margulis! I got a tool that you can just use. Sure you are. <laughs> Okay, we might as well try. I don't think I can put him to sleep, so... Both of you guard. Nope. Ah! Circles enter! Thanks, Scarlet doesn't remember. You are unneeded yet. Do shit! Let's go! So I could probably beat Margulis, but I really don't feel like it. <laughs> Cause we have another mountain of cutscenes after this. But in this game you can't attack yourself, so. Bye, Ziggy. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. It's not like you <laughs> the little girl versus the big burly man. Oh dear. Sure, I can. Shush, Margulis. Wait a minute. What? He won't do anything against. Okay, you have to get a couple rounds to revive Ziggy before he kills Momo. I get it. Usually I just beat this guy, but I can't be asked at the moment. I really don't care. Bye, Momo. I'm sorry. She fell right on top of Ziggy! <laughs> Her head melded into his and they What's formed wrong? a cyborg reality and beastly monster. Is that all you got? Pretty much. Except you play C4 there earlier. He senses something. He should probably get moving. Uh-huh. And now we steal their ship. Margulis is pissed. Thorough, isn't he? Just a little. Hurry up and put out the fire before the ammo ignites! 
See, they usually don't think about that in games. Yes, fire can cause ammo to ignite, especially gunpowder based. Yeah. Hey, back there in the corner. How you doing? My favorite character in this franchise, except for Ghost Ghost. Late. So my second favorite character. Hi. You sexy, sexy beast man. Don't judge me because I like creepy men. I like Ziggy Stardust too. He knows the feeling that he gives off. No, it's nothing. Momo, find a trade column and short jump us out of here. I want to get back on our return path once we shake off the pursuit. Okay. He seemed very calm despite the fact they're being chased. And now back to Xion in the party. Oh, I was right. I wasn't sure if it's this or another scene. Come on, everybody. Let's eat. Of course, Xion cooks. Let's eat. Let's eat. Let's eat. It's always a stereotype that strong women can't cook, but Xion is a strong woman who also Not cooks. Bad, huh? Something I like, because I like cooking too. Chief, it's delicious. Yeah, this ain't bad at all. Oh, come on. How can this girl's cooking be any good? Says as he's stuffing his face. But Captain, you're stuffing your face. <laughs> Thank you, Chaos. Ah, you're thinking the same thing. Up. Don't disturb a man when he's eating. Water. Sure. And yet Xion is a you cooking slave to really? Matthews. <laughs> this is pretty typical for me back home. I have my no good brother to thank for that. He doesn't do a thing all day except sit around and read books. <laughs> well, there's no one on this ship that has any of your skills. Yeah, you think Chaos that's would know how to eat after so long? I guess that's or what happens eat? when you have an Cook. entirely male crew. That's not true. A lot of a lot of men I know are Normally, very very good cooks. There's not even a hint of estrogen on this ship, so you can forget about having a good meal. Who usually does the cooking around here? We take turns. Not that it matters, because the cooking's always bad. There is one person on board who does nothing but eat. Oh. <laughs> Looks at Captain Matthews. What's that? Water. Sure. Chief, um, can I have some water too? Oh, sorry. I hadn't noticed. <sighs> <sighs> Poor Alan. It's okay, Alan. I love you even though the person that you're in love with is can be a horrid, horrid person sometimes. I have reason for not liking Xion. I just haven't seen it yet. So, what are we gonna do now? Well, we certainly can't leave Cosmos to our own devices, can we? Sure you can. She's functioning independently. <sighs> and to think, we were supposed to get vacation time once we completed the startup experiment. Turned you over to the second division. <laughs> You're starting to sound a lot like the captain. There's no use crying over spilled milk, you know. The first thing we need to do is to contact headquarters and ask for instructions. So I guess we're stuck with these guys for a little longer. Hey, Tony and Oliver are pretty awesome. What do you mean? Well, I got a little suspicious, so I checked this ship's registry. Did you know that these guys are with the Kukai Foundation? The Kukai Foundation is awesome, that place Alan. Is bad news. Oh, come on. I heard a rumor that it's just crawling with mutants. A rumor? You're hey, trusting a rumor? That's kind of a racist comment. Listen, Alan. Sure, it's a well-known fact. The Kukai Foundation was established by the Milshin government as a specialized military group. But they only held that status until the completion of the post-war proceedings. Although, they haven't gotten around to demilitarizing quite yet. They're being run like any other valid foundation nowadays. You know, as a matter of fact, their current director received a lot of praise for taking in and protecting victims in the days before the Species Preservation Act. Yay! He's really to be commended. Gainen Kukai. Gainen Kukai. Ha! I remembered correctly. Oh, it's been a while since I played chaos. this. Hey, Chaos. How you doing? Have you gone to see your girlfriend yet? Oh, 
I just dropped in to see if there was anything I could help out with. Oh, thanks. We could use some help drying the dishes. Sure thing. His shorts. Shorts. Hmm, that's everything. I just noticed. I yep. hope Xion's tights are actually oh, pants because this? if not, I think she has the shortest dress in the game. Oh, that's for the commander. Come to think of it, he didn't join us for dinner, did he? No, and I even called him. Oh well, I'll just heat it up and take it to him. Well, how about we call it a day? Good idea. Gotta go get some shut eye. Oh. As we watch 30 did minutes of cutscenes again. No, but where did Cosmos go? He wants to go see his girlfriend. Oh, Cosmos? She's being tuned in her service module down in the hangar. It'll probably take a few more hours. <laughs> oh, did you want to go down and talk to her? I'm sure she liked that. Oh, really? Of course. Oh. Thanks. See you later. Bye. Chaos has a crush, and it's adorable. Okay, then. So, we need to go find Cherenkov, who didn't show up for dinner because he's an antisocial... words I'm not going to say. Um... This way... <laughs> I think. I'm not very good at thinking. Game. Okay, there we go. I got an email! EVS plugin. This just means that we can go back to previous dungeons that we wouldn't have access to realistically. Like, we can't go back to the little Glenday because it exploded. But we can go back there using this. That's pretty much it. Yes, it's very handy. You can revisit the place you've been to before. Everything I just said. And he can bring items back into the real world from virtual reality? What? It makes no sense. Wait a minute. I need to check something. Okay, for a second there, I was thinking I was missing one of the emails. I didn't reply to one of the emails I had needed to for later, but I guess not. Now where the hell is he? Let's try the bar. I think I remember where he is, but I'm not entirely sure. Game. There we go. Apparently there's nothing in here. Welcome, what'll it be? You guys are lucky, we got some good stuff in today, despite the fact nobody can cook. But they have a robot who can serve beer. That's this way. Let's go back to the kitchen. Whew. Of course it does. Hey, Alan. Okay, so, um, is there anything down here? I think he's on the second, f or second basement level. He's on the basement level? Yeah. Maybe? But I also want to say there's something I need to get before I get it, give this to him. I might just be losing my mind, though. That's something that tends to happen with me. I'm kind of crazy. This game also has really long loading times. Probably because it's pretty old. As is the disc, as is my PlayStation. 
I'm actually surprised that the PlayStation has lasted this long. It's had three or four times and the motor just stopped running for months on end. There's a person! In gear! Hi! You seem quite worn out. Don't push yourself. You like a rest? Nah, we'll rest later. Too bad. Don't push yourself too hard. Yon, yon, yon.